Hi there, today we're going to talk about a hot tub uh, floor drain and some uh, little bit of maintenance that you may need over the years. And so um, this is what the Beachcomber hot tub floor drain looks like. This is the whole assembly. So technically you would only see the top part normally. Uh, and so um, what we're going to do here is show you the under part of the top cap. So how this works, uh, see this little white tab here? This little white tab, when it is um, not broken or not needing any maintenance, it'll just look like this, but it could very well look more like this when you're looking on the top part, uh, if this gray part detached from this part, okay? So as you can see, it's just affixed with some special glue, and uh, this little white tab is a method which, if this isn't broken, uh, to remove this part from this uh, quite easily with a flathead screwdriver. So first, I'm just going to show you how to remove it in case it isn't broken and you just want to check, take a look in there and maybe suck up all the water from your, your floor drain. Some people like doing that, uh, those perfectionists out there. So find the little uh, hole on the side. It could be anywhere around the circumference of the floor drain. And right on, on it, I don't know if you can see, but there's a little arrow that says lift. And by that, they mean lift the little white tab. And it's the same white tab that I showed you earlier on. So you will lift it up and you move it counterclockwise. So, and you might need to lift it twice to get over the teeth that you're jumping over. There you go. So, see these teeth? Those are the teeth that you have to lift this white little tab with the flathead screwdriver to jump over, uh, to unscrew successfully. Otherwise you're just going up against these, these teeth. Okay, so what you can see, some of the people that need uh, maintenance on the floor drain over the years, um, this threaded area that threads in to here uh, is, gets disconnected from the gray part. So all you're seeing in here is this X. So how, what you do is you grab uh, needle nose pliers, work really well. You just lightly put them in here, turn counterclockwise. Um, and you might need to lift a little tab if it's still there over the teeth, but you know, you just unscrew it out, get another one of these, and then simply, you can hear the little white tab skipping over those teeth, and that's it. And then you try to unscrew it, you'll see the little white tab, don't, don't torque it too hard, but you'll, you'll feel the white tab stopping you from unscrewing it. Make sure it's nice and snug. And that's it. That's how you change the gray cap, and that's how you maintain the floor drain on a hot tub. This is a Beachcomber hot tub floor drain. I hope this helps for whatever uh, reason you're watching this video. <laughs> Thank you.